When I look at Turkey, when I look at the domestic politics and the domestic realities that Mr. Erdogan faces, what is the number one challenge he has this morning away from the finance and the currency dynamics? I think, thanks for having me, Tom. I think it's primarily about shoring up his relationship with the U.S., but also doing the same with the EU. I think you're right in that the market expectation for a rate hike is, is fairly clear now. But beyond that, I think he has to de-escalate this situation with the U.S., and I think that means <clears throat> some form of written commitment right. to release Pastor Brunson, if he does not do that, the rate hike in a vacuum, I don't think is going to be enough to placate the market. So there needs to be, I think, a parallel move with the U.S. to bring this crisis to bay. Midge, I saw Ian Bremmer in Korea over the weekend. If I look at all of uh, Dr. Bremmer's books, if I look at your work, your essays as well, the single issue here is the U.S. always comes to the rhetorical rescue, providing support in these times, whether it's Bulgaria or Indonesia, whatever. How big a vacuum is there because Mr. Trump doesn't want to come to the rescue? Significant, significant. But I do think there is, there is, there is a, a narrative here, Tom, of Erdogan having overplayed his hand. I think there was a broad agreement on an exchange here between the U.S. and Turkey. And I think Erdogan interpreted, I think, his situation as one of leverage and seeking to extract more concessions from the U.S., specifically related to Halk Bank and the probe there for its violation of Iranian sanctions. And I think that's what has really infuriated the U.S. side. Now, this talk of external yeah. partners, China, Russia, the GCC, these guys are not going to come in and back stop Turkey. And I do think we have seen some more dovish remarks from Erdogan via the EU, because of course, if there is a, a shortfall in financing, it's to Europe that Turkey will look. None of these other partners, I think, are credible.